Yo, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys for tuning in today. Uh, today, it's early in the morning. It's 8.48. Well, early for me. Well, early for me to start filming. But right now I'm heading to work. But after work, I'm going to show you guys how to install a little Alteza. I'm going to be installing an Alteza grill on the IS. Wow, you guys really can't see me, can you? But yeah, at least you guys can hear me. I'm going to be installing an Alteza grill. So yeah, guys. Alright, what is going on everybody? Welcome back. It is nighttime. I finally got out of work, which is no, not that one. There it is. But yeah, I know it's nighttime, but we're still gonna do this new uh, Alteza grill on there, so why not? It's really easy. Let me go get the grill. Hey guys, we got the Alteza grill. It's, it's the cheap one, you know, the, the fake eBay one, but it's still, it's still an Alteza grill. We, I, I got the cheap one because I'm gonna be doing a little fake stuff to it, but yeah. So, first things first. All right, y'all. So, we have the IS open up the hood. We got a black man, Woody. We can't even see this guy. Oh, God. Yeah, What's up, was, Kool Aid man? That was a real Kool Aid move, guys. I was right. about to change and I took off my belt. But then I saw I saw John over here working on his car, so you know. Yeah, guys, we have the Altezza girl right there. First things first, you gotta take off the bumper. No, I know you probably got, you guys got the real stuff. I just have some nuts holding it in there. You know, I have magnets. Have you have magnets? That's even worse. No, uh, I wouldn't be surprised. No. My guy's a little get it up, you know, don't don't judge me, you know. Don't, don't worry about it, you know. Still a two jig. Still a two jig. Alright. I have quick releases, which I got cut off, but there's because they're held by zip ties, but yeah. Alright y'all, so I was able to take off the zip ties. And yeah, all you gotta do is, you know. There it goes. Dude, you just scratched the hole underneath your bumper. Hey, I'm low. You know what I feel about this bumper? You know what? Shut up. I'm getting a new bumper either way, so screw it. You like that? Right sir as hell, but oh well. Hey. Alright, so yeah guys, you take off the front bumper, now you gotta take off the grill. You know, you still got this, it's 10 millimeter, I gotta find it. It's dark out here, I can't see anything. I got a text message. I got another one. Probably my work, uh, group chat. Put the 10 right there, I'll take it off. Throw that over there. And then boys, you, you get the new new. Oh. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. All right, so. Oh, wow. I stopped it. No, I'm kidding. All right, so now you guys get the bumper pack over here. My dude, you got to put the grill on first, bro. No. We'll do it all together. Oh, for real? Yep. Gotta hold it there. Get one side up. Kind of like that. Bro, the focus is the, the focus is so off right now, but I can't. It's manual focus, guys. Yeah, but like I can't adjust it because... Fuck it. Is it because you Yeah, that too. Alright guys, so, yeah, the grill goes inside of this, if I can get it in there. Pop in those nuts, you know. Ooh. Oh, damn. Oh, my butt hole vibrating again. Pop it in, because on the bottom they're kind of like tabs, but not really. I'm Holy shit, yo. Yo. Oh my god, I got a wet. Alright, now I gotta get more zip ties, boy. Thing I got four zip ties because uh, you, know, you only have four zip ties. That's all I need, guy. I mean, I have more in here, but oh, there you go. But they're yellow. Well, black ones, you know, I only have four. Why are you looking at my rust? That's not what I was focusing on. No, nobody was gonna notice that until you pointed it out, John. I mean, I've had that windshield wiper there for many years since 1992. John, were you even born back then? No, guy, of course not. Yes, guy, I was born in 1992. <laughs> but I look, you know, I look 20. Still 20 years old. Guys, look at John struggling to put his bumper on. Hey. Shut up, mister. I'm going to paint my Corolla freaking mint green. Guys, my Corolla is going to be cleaner than this car. Just it's give it a Corolla's minute. Corolla is mint green. <laughs> but it's slammed. I don't like slam. Some people do. Shout out to the stands, people. I mean, I don't want to be saying. John, why are, why are we staying at your ass, bro? Because my ass is beautiful, okay? Your car's ass is beautiful. You're not on there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, as you guys can see, I have Mr. Kool-Aid right behind me. Ooh, red Kool-Aid today. Uh, boy, you still, you just Kool-Aid. But y'all ready for this? Oh, 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 you guys can't see it. Oh, oh, damn. Look at that. Bro, that three-bar grill honestly looks amazing on the IS. Wait, wait, let me let me shed some let me shed some light on the subject. Ooh, baba. Damn, and that looks nice with the blue. 
stuff there. I will be changing that logo later on though. I'll pro I want to get the the old Lexus logo on there. I'm gonna mess around with that logo though, and it's gonna look pretty sick. It's gonna look pretty sick. Sorry, but yeah. And then for big shows, I'll probably put the authentic uh, Altezza logo on there. But damn, that doesn't even look like my car. Whose car is this? Is this yours? I wish. Damn. God damn. Thank you. <laughs> but yeah, guys. There you go. That's how you install an Altezza grill, even though it's a fake one. But yeah, it's it's easy as one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna be ending the vlog right here. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, share, comment, do all that type of stuff. Till next time. Peace out.